All right. So with the Viva Operations Control, we wanted to take a look at the user and what does it take to get make that user more productive and uh, happier in their daily life. So one of the things was giving them access to the data, and we have that with the Viva Insight, where it gives users access to various data wherever they're at in the world. They log in with their user ID, and they can access the information that makes sense to them. Uh, with things like teamwork, it gives them access to information that they need to perform their daily tasks. Uh, things like I'm running in my production facility and I've got access to my, my site and someone has a problem, Samuel Brown has a problem with the turbine. It's got it under center performing. So I'll go and select it and say, well, it has something to do with the wrapper B. So I click wrapper B, but now they have access to the information um, for wrapper B, whether it's the troubleshooting for it, uh, forms that they need to apply to it, or any sort of work instructions that have to do with that particular piece of uh, equipment are all available to them uh, on the fly. And this information can be imprinted inside an application or InTouch or OMI. Uh, this web app or this widget can be applied to that dynamically. So you click on a particular device, this information can be printed for them. So let's say for an example, well, there's a troubleshooting technique. Well, it's a problem. So what are the other troubleshooting capabilities of this? Well, let's say there's a adjustable box tabs that are associated with it. And this is all information that can be generated by users. So users may have information. Okay, I looked at this, this device. There was a problem and I figured out how to fix the problem. And so I'm gonna just post a troubleshooting technique that had to do with how to fix that. So they do that and they publish information. They take a couple pictures. They say, you know what I did? I see this problem. If I do this couple, this tweak to the, the, to the system or to the process, it makes it work and then it can be published and someone can review it and then say, yep, this is an official uh, troubleshooting technique for this particular device. And then it can be made available to other people. And this is also that's done dynamically like you, learning how to use Twitter or something like that. You don't really need to have an instruction of how to use that. It's just all intuitive. There's no training involved. It's just you make the, the content, you publish it, and make it available for others. So, yeah.